Good morning, everybody. We're in this really beautiful park we found on iOverlander. Places like this that really make urban camping possible. It's nice. And we're under this nice canopy of trees. I don't know if you can hear the birds. Frank is loving life right now. Come here. Um, and I'm just trying to get my friend Trent out of bed. He is sleeping in this morning while I'm getting some work done. I think he's gonna make me some coffee and breakfast, so he'll redeem himself, it's okay. Oh, look who's awake. Good morning, good morning. Hello. Hi. How'd you sleep, babe? Oh, just pretty regular. <laughs> just a regular day, average day, <laughs> average morning. How'd you sleep? You slept great. I wish I could have kept sleeping with you. You guys are new to the channel and you don't know what's up. This is our espresso machine. <laughs> it's legit. What are we gonna do today? Just work and be boring? <laughs> kind of. Hopefully you guys want to see what it's like for us on a regular day because I think you guys have seen a lot of our like fun days and days where we do cool activities and today is just kind of a regular day. So here's our life on a regular day. It starts with me making the bed. <laughs> it's true, that's a regular day. I wouldn't say that there's gender roles in this house. Generally, I make the bed. Generally, he makes the coffee and the breakfast. Generally, I empty out the toilet. Gross. I don't know why that that's my job. Why Why did that become my job? I don't want it. Because I said I don't that's gross, it. let's get rid of the toilet, and you said, I'll clean the toilet. We need to have the toilet. Oh, okay. Like, okay. <laughs> Great. I didn't even want a toilet at the beginning. And Trent really convinced me that it was important. And now I love it. And I guess now I have to clean it. I, I, I still don't see the logic in that. I really needed to get my dose of coffee in. So I already started, but you can see here is my latte art for the day. It's an and sign. <laughs> or maybe some sunglasses. You said it was a bow tie. Maybe a bow tie. This is a person, a woman kneeling with her on her knees with her feet tucked behind her and her hands in her lap. You can see that's her head and that's her shoulder down to her elbow and her hands in front of her. That's her butt and her knees and her feet tucked under her. The creativity that Trent is able to express in these really intricate latte art designs. Rude. All right, well, we're gonna scarf down on our banana bread and our lattes now. Scarf down on? I don't know. Huh. We're gonna scarf them down. Okay. <clears throat> this was our first time using the muffin, the, the muffin, using the oven, <laughs> and it turned out really well. I'm amazed. All right. About time we get to work. Why don't you put on a shirt? This one? Yep. Oh. That work? Perfect. Come sit down. Let's get to work. Let's do this shiz. Make that money. Yeah. Let's go. <laughs> so this is pretty much what we do for the majority of the day when we're working. We have our solid six to eight hours of editing and video conferencing and writing books and responding to comments and managing all the social media. Trent is in the middle of writing an ebook on how we built our van. Anyway, so now we're gonna get to work and we'll uh, pick you guys up when we're ready to hit the road because once we're done working today we're gonna head up to Bellingham. So there was two or three hours or however long we've been working and now we're going Ugh. to make some bruschetta for lunch. So let's get that underway. Van made bruschetta. Van cheddar. All right, so maybe I lied. We're not gonna eat lunch right now. We're actually gonna take Frank out, play a little bit of Frisbee, then we're gonna go get me a haircut. 
and then we're gonna eat lunch. It's been a long time between breakfast and lunch. We're not happy about it, but we're trying to get as much done today as we can because we gotta to drive to Bellingham. So let's go play frisbee with Frank. So now we're gonna go get my hair cut after we played fetch with Frank, he's nice and tired. I need to go get this thing trimmed up so that I can look more like a respectable person instead of somebody that lives in a van. All right, now we're here at Spins Barber. About to go get my hair chopped. Yeah. Allie's making me do this because oh, no. she doesn't like my hair. No, no, no. It's true, I it don't needs, even want to cut it. It just needs uh, some help today. Hear the word need? <laughs> anyway, let's go get it cut. All right guys, how do I look? Just got my hair chopped at Spins Barber. I think it looks great. I like it. I think you wanted that haircut more than you let on. Now we're gonna make some van bruschetta. Yes, I'm starving. Allie's starving, Ugh. so we're gonna eat. Okay. scarf down the rest of this bruschetta and we're gonna hit the road and head to Bellingham mm -hmm. but I feel like the drive is gonna be super boring so we'll just like wake you guys up when we get to Bellingham <sighs> what's up guys we made it it was a super long drive it's only supposed to be two hours but there's so much traffic today yeah insane my leg is really tired from going <laughs> break gas break gas break poor gas. guy and that was the traffic going out of seattle yeah it's true nightmare yeah we made it to bellingham which bellingham is amazing yeah it's a we, we're just place. so happy to be back here this is great it's like really smoky though there's like fires that are yeah. east of here and like all the smoke is blowing out this way which kind of sucks for riding bikes because yeah. you don't want to be like yeah you know, doing a lot of exercise when the air quality is that bad. But we're going to do it anyways, because we're in We got to take advantage of being here, so <laughs> we're going for it. <laughs> yeah. We stopped at Sally something or other park. I don't know the name, Sally Park maybe. And I think we're going to make dinner. Yeah. Now we're going to go back to the van and make okay. some food. Bye. So... Like pretty much most of our videos, we end the day with food. We like to eat. We're gonna eat right now. Tonight, we've decided on a gourmet meal of sandwiches. Pretty exciting. We got some bread, bread, turkey, gouda, relish. Um, and one beer. One beer for both of us. Some mayo, some mustard, some salsa. Some artichoke spinach dip. We're and just gonna- turkey just happens to be this? frozen. Ooh, jalapenos. We're gonna see how that works out. The thing about living in a van is you really just gotta like be able to roll with the punches and if things don't go your way, you gotta be stoked anyways. Maybe that just goes for all kinds of life, but it's really it's really helpful in van life, so. It is necessary in van life yeah. because nothing ever goes your way, ever. And you gotta just be like, all right, what new adventure does this opportunity present to me today? Cause I can't do what I wanted to do. That's exactly right. Some nice whole grain bread. Turkey, jalapenos, relish, gouda, mayo, mustard, and of course, some Stacy's pita chips, garlic and parmesan. Something like that. Something like that. Mm -hmm. And we're going all out tonight. Actually, we're getting some smoothie on the side. Today's evening smoothie has got <laughs> bananas, blueberries, raspberries, sprouts, a little bit of yogurt, lots of ice. And then topping it off with some almond milk is usually a good call, so give it a little juice to blend with. Mm. 
Cheers to you guys too. Cheers. Mmm. That is delicious. Not that much time to eat. Mm-hmm. It's eight o'clock right now. Mm-hmm. We've got less than an hour to get to the movie theater because we're gonna go see the new Mission Impossible with a couple friends. Mm. Mm. This is basically an average day in van life. Mm -hmm. Pretty normal. We're pretty basic. But we got some really exciting stuff coming your way. We're just going to be grinding out that mate and bacon. Mate and bacon. Mate and bacon. We're here to mate and bake. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, if you guys don't know, Bellingham is like some of the best mountain biking in the country as far as I'm concerned. Mm -hmm. The We've... trail builders here are just like top notch. Oh man. So there'll be some mountain bike vlogs with mm -hmm. some mountain bike videos mm -hmm. coming your way. Hot action served fresh. <laughs> if you guys haven't liked this video and you made it to this point, mm -hmm. you should like it because it really helps us. Mm -hmm. In the comments, please tell us what's your go to easy dinner? Yeah, we're Obviously, looking for dinner recommendations. Yeah. We're living on some sandwiches tonight. What else could we be living on? Easy, quick, delicious dinners. Hit us with a recommendation in the bottom. Like the video. Subscribe if you're not already. Bye. Thanks for watching, guys. You guys remember the scene in Finding Nemo when Dory is speaking whale to the whale? That's how I feel when I speak dog to Frank, and he totally responds. Look at this.